Cooking with a dirty grill isn't just nasty, it's downright dangerous. All those little bits of food and grease clogging up your grill, well, they could cause a fire and they make your food taste pretty bad. I'm gonna show you how to clean your grill properly and safely. When your grill is cold and gas is turned off completely, start by opening it up and removing any parts that might get in the way. I'm talking about the grill grates, heat deflector bars, heat shields, etc. A lot of grease and food particles tend to end up inside the grill's interior, also known as the grill box. Use a cheap putty knife, metal or plastic, or old spatula to scrape the sides of the grill chamber free of as much gunk as you can. If you have a gas grill, one part that often gets clogged is its burner tube. Use a nylon or steel wire brush to gently clean the small holes on the tubes. Be sure to brush from the center of the tube outwards, moving sideways, not up and down. Otherwise, you may push debris into the tube or holes themselves. Assemble the grill, then turn it on to its highest temperature setting and close the hood. After a few minutes, open the lid and scrape the grates vigorously with a metal grill scraper. If you don't have one of those, then use a nylon brush, but only if the grill is cold. Certain practices can help discourage deposits of dirt and grease from forming. One method is to grease the grates of your hot grill with a little cooking oil right before you start cooking. In the same vein, scrubbing grates with a raw onion is another tactic you can try. If you do have a grill brush without bristles, it's a good idea to scrape your hot grates both before and after grilling. Of course, performing a full cleaning every few months is the best way to keep your grill cooking safely and looking good. 